Ta-ta. Okay. So Genshin stream won't be too, too long. Uh... Okay, I'll do surprise gift last. Let me do. Closer. He Don't get frostbite. Freeze. Have you tried doing pure? Have you done your pure, uh, pure fiction stuff? Delta, I have, uh, with your character, since a lot of your characters are built, do you, uh, are you able to handle pure fiction pretty easy, or, uh, like, are you able to get, like, all of pure fiction three-starred? Delta, I know you just got here. Uh, me and Ty were talking about pure fiction. Let it rain. <laughs> yeah, me, me and uh, Ty were talking about pure fiction uh, since uh, before you uh, before you got here, Delta. I wouldn't say easy. So you do you, so you struggle a little bit too. The reason why I'm asking is I've been watching videos on Pure Fiction because I'm trying to. I know by now, but like the people I'm watching Pure Fiction, their characters are 80, but mine are 70, but their talents will be eight pretty much, and I'm hope like, well, eight eventually. Uh, so I'm hoping I'm like, uh, I want to at least get stage three done. If I can't get stage four done, that's fine, but. I, but I want to try and do the pure fiction. I I'm trying to get because I want to get the jades before it ends. Yeah, no worries, no worries, Delta. <laughs> uh, how you doing, by the way, Delta? <sighs> well, 
water strategies. Oh, I know, I know, I know. I'm gonna. It looks like I'm, like I'm gonna be like leveling up, uh, Yukong and Lynx, uh, but also Wawa, Clara, and Doctor Ratio as an emergency, emergency. Like if I'm really, so I can try and get Jade. But I want to try and do, uh, uh, like I want to see how far I can go with the. With a complete like free to play, free to play characters. I know a lot of people have using have been using Pela, and I'm like, oh, I don't got that. Oh, they're off to the side. Wind blade. Oh, so sorry. <laughs> Let's spark things up a little. All right, there we go. All right, let's talk to Rudolph. I like how when I get like when I get other of the daily commissions, I get them for almost a week. But yet, whenever I do get Tales of Winter, I only get it for like one day, and then I it won't show up till like a month later. Like, hey, Jer. Yeah, don't, uh, hi, Humberto. Yeah, guys, don't worry. I'll be, uh, Gitchin's gonna be short. Just gonna take care of the day two thing. Not long. Uh, it'll only be, like, uh, about 40 minutes because, uh, 10 minutes for the pet cat, and then I gotta talk to Amber, and that's gonna probably be, like, at least 30 minutes. Uh, and then we'll be on Star Rail. Uh, Star Rail, what I'm gonna do... It is a short stream. Go to sleep. I won't burn all my Trailblaze power. I'll burn some of it. So no relic farming today. Uh, I'll just farm quick credits just to get my dailies done. Um, uh, which I give. Huh? It's a present to someone. Picking gifts is an adventure and a half, isn't it? I want to give my wife Juliana, but I have no idea what to pick. My thousand thanks for those from the sometimes it's always possible to find the perfect one. I already can't think of anything and ask someone in the city only knew how best to ask. Who exactly should I ask? Uh, how about Madre? Madre, oh, she runs that souvenir shop. Doesn't she certainly would have some good choices on sale? Could I trouble you to make a trip over her shop? Her Lily's out for a moment, so I have to wait until she gets back since Juliana's still at work. Besides, I want to give her as far as so I can't afford to let her know. Okay. Yeah, it might be a little bit because... Because once we... Because after... Because... The four likely characters to have reruns now is... Fushuan, Topaz, Argenti, and Wawa... And then it'll be the Panacone characters. Um, they'll probably do like one Panacone character rerun, and then they could probably bring some of the OGs, OGs back, maybe. But yeah, probably by then that'll be when the Panacone stuff uh, will rerun. A double five star, not Kafka though. Oh man. Saturday, Saturday, Saturday. My Luocha pulls. And then depending on those pulls, we'll see if I can also try and pull for Acheron.
But yeah, I'll be back on at like nine o'clock in the morning. No, uh, no, ten o'clock in the morning. My bad. Ten o'clock in the morning. Uh, that's why. Like, I, 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 I fixed my sleep schedule. Like, I've been waking up at like nine, ten o'clock in the morning. Do you know anything about presents? Presents, got here, what do you need them for? Uh, present for Juliana. Uh, present for Juliana. Uh, present for Juliana for you, I presume. You do need to tell me who it's from because it makes a difference when it's recommended. Oh, it's for Ralph, I see. Hmm, let me think. Ah, yes, I do have presents that she'll definitely like. Uh, that said, he <laughs> did you bring enough money? The present will run you 900 Mora. Small beans, here you go. Well, aren't you straightforward? Alright, I've already stopped. Write the present, take it. Oh, yes, don't open it, you know. Presents are meant to be strides after all. Opening it, others' presents hardly considered as polite either. Come take a look. There will definitely be something that catches your eye. Me and Tyra are in cahoots. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I am a surfer. Special program. Once this cat event's done, uh, I'm going to do test run and stuff and check teapot out because new furniture got added. Did you get a present from Marjorie? We did, sure did. We did? Oh, thank you. Wait, did you buy this? How much is it? I'll reimburse you. I mean, it's a present from me to Juliana. I can't just spend your money right here. Uh, it's a little on the side. Hold on a moment. I'll get it. That should be enough, yes. Uh, I do hope that Juliana will like it. Oh wait, they already announced special program for a kitchen? Oh my gosh, speaking of this Friday, oh I can't wait for this weekend because episode 2 of the 3 anime series that I'm watching is coming out. That and Black Butler. The new season of Black Butler will start this weekend. Okay, I I I I didn't know it. They already they finally announced it. That's good. That's good. So I'm looking forward to this Friday. Woohoo! Ad Astra Abyssosk, welcome to the Adventurers Guild. Thank you for completing today's commissions. Here is your reward. Does puzzle stream like uh yeah usually sometimes puzzle streams late some uh but only on the weekends. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Welcome to the Adventurers Guild. For Sugi and Silverwolf? Okay, 
Uh, da 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 da. By the uh, tomorrow I'm pulling on TOF. I was supposed to do that. D now that I finally fixed my sleep schedule, I will be pulling on TOF because um, Asuka is about to be ending. And depending on our look, I could try and go ahead and pull for the other one. Dang it! Well, I had to get my, I had to get a drink. Like I have a six pack uh, of bottles. Uh, I'm gonna I'm drinking Crush Orange Crush right now. Um, but yeah, the whole six pack was here and freaking the thing was being stubborn, and letting go of the drink. Oh my gosh, I kind of hope with the um these pools for TOF actually go better compared to the other ones. And I mean, I saved up. I saved up, but they kind of moved the banners a little bit on me. Ow, 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 ow. We'll still do a test, try, uh, test run on the weapons, too. Um, Alright, yeah, let's go... Uh, let's check the event out. Meow. Bunny hopping home. The clever and keen bunny likes to jump and hop around. If I can see different scenery while leaping about, then going in and out of treehouse, I'll probably be a even happier than usual. Oh, that sounds cute. Only two more days left. Because, uh... All right. I wonder if this. Th I, I don't. I, I don't know. I don't think it's gonna be a permanent thing. Would have been. It would be nice, but yeah. I. I, I think this might be a limited thing. Dang! I can't believe all the Tino's almost here. Yeah, like barely two weeks left. I'm guaranteed. But even then, I'm still gonna wait till the end of her banner. I'm gonna wait till like two days of her banner and then pull. All right. Complete setting up the feline home and finish. Find them all. <laughs> hmm. 
Yeah, I got the glided cradle. The calming blue. Philosophy of setting, sitting. And the bedtime story. Okay, yeah, we're good. I love it. it makes a cute little bell sound. All right. Oh, look at the cute little setup. So we got this with the chair and Snowball over there. So this cat's name is most likely Bunny. All right, here we go. Don't worry, it's a short little conversation. But we can always talk to Amber again. 
Meow, 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 meow. Hmm, both Bunny and Amber have a point. <laughs> Why would... Oh, so that's it. A most astute observation. Hold on, I'm a bit lost. Alright, so it's neutral. Um... I'm gonna go with, hold on, I'm a bit lost. Actually, Pong doesn't really get it either, but she can tell that Amber and Money have reached an understanding. She'll never know? What do you mean, Aunt Steph can have a cup of orange crush? Okay, so I have the bot dang, I can't believe, uh... I still felt like yesterday. I know, I know, it's going really fast. Uh, Ether, Paimon, you're here. I was thinking about going to look for you. Yeah, I was reading re 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 the, some of the comments I missed. I've already heard all about how you're helping uh, Valerina with the Furball Fortress. All the crush bottles? Bruh, come on. They are making me thirsty again. That's the Ether and Paimon for you. The second you're back in Mondstadt, you're already being such a huge help. I, Dottery Knight, will fulfill the, uh, um, hold on. All right, sorry about that text message. Um, that's Ether and Pama for you the second you're back in Mondstadt. You're already being such a huge help. Um, I, Darn, will fulfill my mission no matter it, of its nature. The defense of the cats of Mondstadt is one of my many responsibilities. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I love it. The defense of the cats of Mondstadt is one of many responsibilities. I also like the, the first one too. But I love the second one more. Speaking of which, uh, what were you and Bunny discussing just now? You seem to be having a really fun conversation. Meow, meow, meow. <laughs> it's just saying that water is the best drink in the world and none of y'all can change my mind. I mean, it's more healthier too. Oh, I was just asking Bunny about the weather and whether or not it would rain. Oh yeah, usually cats can sense when it's supposed to rain. Because cats hate water, so they, of course, 
So they, I guess they could tell because they don't want to get wet. <laughs> huh? Do cats know that kind of thing? <laughs> Lisa said something about that. Uh, I think a lot, I think a lot of people like to use two hands to drink because they don't want to drop it. Um. Restaurants, uh, they'll give us straws to put in our drinks, our glass drinks, and I'll just make sure to drink out of the straw and I barely move the cup. Because I don't want to, like, accidentally spill it or drop it. Alright, haha, <laughs> Lisa said th something about that. According to a book she read, cats are very sensitive to humidity and don't like the feeling of being wet. Hey! <laughs> I didn't know about the hum- uh... Yeah, I just knew about the whole, they didn't like being wet, so I knew, like, they would like, definitely like, stay indoors if it's gonna rain. Nothing wrong with using two ends. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. It helps make me make sure you don't drop the cup. Trust me, I I, <laughs> I drop cups. I have dropped cups in the past. So if you notice sudden increase in humidity, they'll start nervously pawing their faces and licking their fur. Same, uh, yeah, animals have some good keen senses sometimes. Uh, once a cat does something like that, it's a sign that a large rainstorm is likely on its way. Hi, LP. Uh, how are you liking the event? Oh my gosh, I Oh yeah, by the way, guys, did you know, uh, if you, uh, in Chiori's, uh, little shop on one of the desks... Uh, there's a piece of paper, and it talks about Sniznaya and Nat Natlin. So if you kind of want to know more Natlin and Sniznaya lore, uh, definitely, uh, definitely go into the boutique. I think you can only get into the boutique after Chori Story Quest. Whoa, Parman had no idea. That's so cool. Guess we just have to learn something amazing by accident. But yeah, once the cat event ends, I'm going to get the waypoints and Statue of the Seven for Chinny Valley and try and be careful not to activate the, uh, the quest. Yeah, uh, although it's rare, but a person can be born with a condition that can make allergic to... Oh, dang. I know there, I know there's people who, uh, they have to be, like, full quarantine because... Uh, their immune system so weak, so if they actually go outside, it could kill, it could be lethal to them, so they're usually in like a, like a type of bubble or like a very sealed place. Uh, that's cool, guess we just learned something amazing by accident. In that case, Ether, let's pay more attention to cats during our travels, that way we won't keep getting so, uh, soaked by huge downpours from those big black clouds like I watched a movie about it I forgot what it's called uh about a girl who uh was in this ha fancy house that was made because if she goes outside it would kill her and a guy moved in next door and they slowly got t to know each other oh man I wish I knew the title of that movie I'm sure if I look up movies of like like if I like of like it'll probably it should pop up um, in that case, uh, I suppose we'll have to pay more- Oh yeah, this is neutral, by the way. I suppose we'll have to pay more attention going forward. Um, 
In that case, either let's pay more attention to cats during our travels, that way we won't keep getting soaked by huge downpours from those big black clouds. Uh, since when haven't I paid close attention to cute kitties? Oh my gosh, yeah, like, we have a few, there's a few quests, we have, like, one or two quests, that and plus, uh, Inazima, that's all, like, we, where we literally interact with cats. Uh, so, yeah, we definitely, what's up? Crash last night, was able to step by the stream. Gotcha. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go with since I haven't uh, paid close attention to cute kitties. I originally came here to ask Valerina about something. But just as I was talking to her, this little kitty snuggled up close to me and yawned so loudly, it was just too cute. Since she was so affectionate towards me then, well, then I need to show how friendly I am too. I love how we're getting to know like which of the Genshin characters are like real big on cats that and they secretly have a soft spot. Like, oh man. We need more you wouldn't like we have not had an event in Inazuma in a while. Like we in a zoom, like, uh, we always go back to Leeway and Mondstadt for our yearly stuff. Uh, we've had a few events in Fontaine since Subsidy Region. Um, but I kind of want to get some events in Simuru and, uh, or in Azuma again. That's when I remembered what Lisa told me, so I went ahead and asked Bunny about the weather. I'll do co- I'll be doing co-op after the- after I talk to Amber, uh, cause there's an option I could talk to her again, and I wanna, like, I'm trying to get ahead- go ahead and take care of the NPCs for the day, so like, when I do all the events out, uh, like, I've pretty much talked to everybody. Uh, but she responds by rubbing her face, then wagging her tail, then lying on the ground, snuggling against my hand. So it is actually going to rain or not over the next few days. Alright, we can talk to, again for uh, to Amber for just a little bit lore stuff, and then we'll be done. Hey, you two, you're doing such a great job managing this place. Never imagine you'll be as good as this, too. As long as you're enjoying yourself, Amber. What kind of cats do you like, Amber? Okay, as long as you're enjoying yourself, Amber. Noodles are buy noodles, then make my own ramen. I know it takes longer to make ramen noodles, because you gotta really, because with the dough, you really gotta, like, uh, cause you gotta, like, make the noodles themselves. Uh, I usually just, I just buy the stove noodles, and then, uh, I have, and then just cook them on the stove and, and, and everything. That's right, Valerina also orders food from Good Hunter. Uh, so, Amber, you can stay here and play when you're on vacation.
Oh, speaking of work, have you finished all your recent missions, Amber, when you were asking Bunny about the weather? Was it because you have to go on gliding patrol soon? Relax, no need to worry. I won't be going out on patrol today. I was just asking Bunny about the weather to make conversation, that's all. I'm here today for two reasons. First, to satisfy my own curiosity, and second, to help a friend. I have a friend who is very skilled at I'm, I have a friend who is very skilled at, at making handcrafts and used to make all kinds of toys for kitties and doggies. Many of the furnishings at the cat's tail were made by her. Ooh. After I heard about the Furball Fortress, she contacted Valerina and supplied some furniture and toys, the very same ones you see here, in fact. Ooh, I'm curious on who she's talking about. Like, is this giving a hint to, like, maybe another future playable character, or is it's just story stuff? What I did imagine was that Valerina couldn't bear to accept donations instead on paying her. Oh, couldn't bear to accept donations and insisted on paying her. My bad. Anyone watch Made in uh, Made in the Abyss? Abyss? I wa I've watched all of Made the Made in Abyss, and I'm like, the manga's still ongoing, and I'm like, uh, I want I want to do new stuff for Made in the Abyss. Now that the fortress is a few days into its trial opening, my friend wants to understand whether or not cats like her toys, but she doesn't really have time, and she doesn't understand cats very well either. Rosaria? I don't know if Rosaria... Mm, Rosaria's just there to, like, be... To be for medical stuff. I don't know if Rosaria actually, like, knows, um... Uh, is, like, a carpenter or something. So, I'm here to conduct an on-the-spot inspection, and the results are in full marks. Uh, yeah, heads up, Made in the Abyss, uh, can be, uh, can be kind of dark, night, like, if you ever watch the anime Neverland, uh, yeah, it, it kind of gets, like, that kind of dark, but, like, it's a different story than Neverland, because Neverland's about orphans and stuff like that, while Made in the Abyss is about, like, this very deep, deep crater that n there, no one knows how down it goes, but it's, it, go it like, it could go like to like the center of the earth or, or something like we don't know uh but it's definitely a, a big crater go deep down and they're exploring and there's these monsters and people could die exploring and there's also a curse involved with it it's uh it's it very interesting oh never okay okay uh if you don't let uh they're dark. They're dark animes, meaning, uh, meaning like there's death involved, uh, and it, and it does get dark. Like, uh, like if Tokyo Ghoul, Tokyo Ghoul Parasite, 
not that bloody bloody, but like it's uh like it's kind of close to that dark. If even the person making cat toys can't communicate with them, how do you manage it, Amber? Uh, natural talent. This is also neutral. Um. Uh, you practice with Baron Bunny? <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm gonna go with you practice with Baron Bunny. Oh my gosh, you guys wanna know what anime I'm re watching right now, though? Because uh, it was only 12 episodes. Uh, and I'm already on, pretty much almost on episode 6. Um, Clockwork Planet. Because, yes, I'm a, I'm a gear, I'm, a, I, like, automatons, uh, gears, stuff like that. I can't help it. I think those are so cool. Just knowing, like, something, like, made out of tiny stuff can, like, is something we could use every day or, like, something else. This just, like, always interests me. You practice with Bear and Bunny. I don't know either. Maybe you're right, either. Those do both sound like good reasons, but maybe there's another, and that's my duty as an outrider. Um, they are. They are. Uh. Yeah, Tok a lot of people like Tokyo Go and Parasite. Um, as long as you don't mind, uh, bl uh, blood, gore, uh. And you like and like if if you like horror movies then you'll like like them. Um, they're not like scary scary. It's just more of just like uh, it's like the slash slasher part of the horror movies. Uh, but yeah, if you can stand horror movies, then yeah, th that's why I meant like dark anime because uh, some people aren't into like dark stuff like horror movies and stuff while others can handle it. It's back? What's back? The doctor with green hair? Your sound went poof? I was mo I was moving my I was moving stuff st I was moving some stuff uh because the wire was in the way, that probably was what made the sound. As I was moving, um, if I was moving some stuff, that might have been it. Um, but yeah, uh, if you like horror movies and stuff like that, then yeah, those are those are good animes to watch. Didn't hear me for a second. Oh, well, I did. Get, I did go quiet because I was moving. Uh, I don't know either. Maybe you're right, Ether. That they'll sound like a good reason. Maybe there's another, and that's my duty as an outrider. Outriders are different from scouts who need both, who need to both quickly obtain intelligence on the enemy, but also strike first. Outriders need to do the best to stay out of sight and use every means as they're disposable to gather intel. Sometimes the chirping of birds, the bouncing of squirrels, and the grunting of boars can tell me what I need to know about monsters. Oh, Dr. Stone. Yeah, yeah. That one's a good one. Um, I love I love some of the sci-fi stuff too. Like when it comes to like like Gundams, mechs, stuff like that. I might not see. I've seen a few episodes of Star Trek, not all of it, but like definitely, I'm definitely a nerd when it comes to like Transformers and stuff and science stuff. Yeah. Now, some of the science stuff, there, there's going to be stuff that I don't really understand or fully know, but I still think it's, like, cool. If I'm lucky, animals that are familiar with me will connect, uh, come out and warn me of monsters off their own accord when they see me uh, in the areas I often patrol.
Whether they do it by chirping, bouncing, or grunting, they all mean pretty much the same, like, thing. Oh, scary, there are bad guys over there. We're almost done talking with Amber. This part's about to be- This part's always the long- It's always the first part that's the longest, and then the middle one is, like, like, sh pretty short, and then the last one's, like, just a goodbye, short, simple. Compared to those sensitive wild animals, the cats outside are really easy to communicate with, uh, ne with, never mind these super well-behaved, uh, little kitties in the furball fortress. Paimon never imagined that Outwarders would have to master skills like those. If it was Paimon, she'd probably get dizzy just trying to listen for a little while. Oh, it's not some essential skill. It's just some uh, something I've picked up from my experience for an Outrider. The most important skill to master is using a wing glider. Oh, on that note, Ether, your wing glider skills haven't gotten really gotten rusty in your long absence from Mondstadt, have they? Uh, this is neutral. Would you like to test me personally, Instructor Amber? My gliding skills soar upwards by the second. I do like Tekken uh, Bloodline 2. I remember that one. Uh... I'm gonna go with my gliding skills for upward by the second, because it's kind of funny. Now, that's the spirit. That's what I like to hear. I mean, ah, oh, crud. That's the spirit. That's what I like to see. It's a Netflix original? Oh. Man, I really gotta get... My Netflix... I haven't been working on my iPad because I need to update it. <laughs> and I haven't updated it yet. Because I, I, I do, when it comes to my iPad, I don't do automatic updates. I do manual ones because sometimes I'll delete an app. And I'm like, eh, I don't know if I want to update it. Because I'm probably going to end up delete deleting it. Um, time we meet, I'll be sure to give you a real test. Oh, how far, uh, did you finish stage three or are still getting super close on finishing it now, Wolf? You might just need to keep leveling up traces and characters and, uh, and everything. Or just keep, keep gotta level up the relics too. Still getting close? You want to show me, uh, Star Rail ain't going to take me too long if you want to show me your progress on, on Star Rail tonight, Wolf, but that's up to you. Uh... If your skills really are sharper than before, then I'll personally make you some sticky honey roast. Ooh, sticky honey roast. Hi, Timothy. Uh, got season one of Solar Moon. Uh, looking forward to seeing it. Hey, nice. This, uh, the OG Sailor Moon or Sailor Moon Crystal? Yeah, Sailor Moon's good. Uh, the, the one on Netflix is Sailor Moon Crystal. Uh, I forget if they had the original Sailor Moon. But I know, I do remember they had Sailor Moon Crystals. Dude, my fa I love Usagi because, bruh, like, she's so relatable to me. Uh, if I had to choose a character not Usagi, though, that's female uh, as a character I like. Uh... There's uh, uh, there is Ami, but I also, cause she's so smart, um, but there's also, uh, 
the S Sailor Venus, uh, Minako. I think that's how, how, how Japanese name is said. Uh, the one that's Sailor Venus, I kind of like her too because, uh, But, uh, and then the, the last one that I really like, uh, would be Haruka. Uh, I think, uh, Haruka was Sailor, Sailor Uranus. Yeah, Sailor Uranus. The short blonde hair one that, uh, I, I, I know a lot of people... <laughs> So, if you watch Sailor Moon Crystal, they go by the manga on how it is, but the old, original Sailor Moon, they changed it up a little bit because of censorship and stuff like that, and, uh, from the, from, not in the Japanese version, but the English dub version, the original one, they censored it a bit. If your skills are sharper than before, then I personally like you, oh, 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 yay, Amber's Sticky Honey Roast. Um, Usagi is a common name in Japan. It means strawberry. Like, if you ever watch Bleach, uh, Ichigo... No, not... No, Usagi means rabbit. Uh, so Usagi is a common name. Uh, Ichigo is also a common name because it means strawberry. You know, Bleach. Uh, the main character from Bleach. My bad. I, I, I stumbled there for a second. Yeah, uh, uh, okay. Uh, let's find a time to practice a bit more soon ether you've got to make sure you can uh back your boast up one minute gets dark the show progresses is uh, demachi because oh my gosh no oh man i remember that demachi Okay, hold on, guys. Uh, if you're... Oh, by the way, the English name for Damachi is... Is it wrong to pick up girls in the dungeons? Dude, dude, dude. There's too many girl characters simping for that boy. Like, I like... Honestly, I'm gonna be honest. I like him and his goddess together. That's my favorite pairing. Uh, but that boy is too dense to know, to real, to, that boy is too dense, man. Oh, and then with other characters, he gets flustered, but I'm like, oh my gosh. Like, oh, why can't, like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, like, I, I watch, like, there's so many animes that's like that, like, dude, Vampire, uh, Strike, no, Strike, Blood Strike, dang it, man, it's been a while, Blood Strike, uh, or something, that one vampire with the guy with blue hair, he pretty much has, like, a harem of girls that sent for him, too, there's two that are canon, though, like, he actually ends up with, like, two girls, and it's, and it's like that. Like, I, I always, like, like, I love how, like, some, some of the animes are harems, but he ends up, but the guy sticks with, like, like, Zero Familiar, that was my first one, Zero Familiar, uh, I saw it as a kid, I was, like, 11 when I saw it, and, and everything, and I, I was just so, ha like, Saito Louise, definitely my favorite, <laughs> No, uh, I want to see Tenjo. Gotcha. By the, don't forget if you ever watch Kenshin. Kenshin has a remake. Unfortunately, Ella, for someone else, knows what I mean. Stuff. Oh yeah, I know, I know. Cause we're trying not to spoil. Oh, but but still, I can't help it. Cause it looks like she had a. Cause the very first season, 
It was like those two had a thing. It was like those two had a thing for each other, and I was like, oh my gosh, it's so cute. Uh, and then we progress, and then there more girls show up, and it's like, oh no. <laughs> okay, what kind of cats do you like, Amber? This one's not that long. Me, I'm not really sure myself. Each cat is cute in its own way, so it's really hard to compare. Man, I want to say the new one nine one one episode, but I gotta wait till Thursday. Each cat is cute in its own way, so it's really hard to compare. That's true. Fur color, build, fur patterns, eyes, ears. There are combinations of characters beyond cat. If Paimon had to choose, she would be able. She wouldn't be able to pick either. Though, when you put it that way, I don't think I've ever seen a red cat. A red cat? A pyro kitty? <laughs> oh my god. This is neutral. A red cat. A pyro kitty. <laughs> there are... Well, there's more orange cats. Because orange is... Uh... Oh my gosh, dude. Do you guys remember the Wanderer, Dilu, Kaching little cat art, official art? Oh my gosh, red cat. I think they're. I think this is giving a reference to Dilu, uh, the cat Dilu. I'm gonna go with a pyro kitty. <laughs> is if there really are red cats? Why am I bet they're super energetic and rack the whole house that they got upset. <laughs> Well, it's about to be played, so you can find all matter amazing and mystery things here. Just think about it, there are slimes of all different elements and colors, so maybe there are cats with all sorts of fantastic and exotic colors in some places we never heard of. Yeah, you know, the Grand Master's really experienced and knowledgeable, so maybe he's seen some during his travels. Um, I know that... D have you seen the movie, Julius? Have you seen the movie yet? I haven't. I, ha I haven't. Uh, I'm gonna check Crunchyroll or Netflix to see if they added the... If the movie's been added yet, though. Not like... Not like sometime this week. Not like after stream or anything like that, like sometime this weekend. Once he comes back, let's find an opportunity to sit down and talk together. We can ask him then. Uh, Damachi, uh, AKA, is it wrong to pick up girls in the dungeons? All right. Last thing with Amber, and it's super short. We're just gonna say goodbye to her. Uh, that's the English name. Uh, is it wrong to pick up girls in dungeons because they're explorers and stuff like that? It's like a, it's like an anime, like, that's based on, like, those RPG games, but, uh, a little bit different. Thanks for the compliments. We'll keep uh, at it. Yeah, but don't forget to rest. Try not to tie yourself, tire yourself, and Paimon out. Ba -ba -da. All right, and I'll be turning uh, co-op in just a second. Let me teleport to um, Thunder Fury because since, since I'm in Monster, I'm, I'm just pushing with the Thunder Fury domain, and most likely we're just gonna get fodder anyway. So, because we almost got Yao Yao's thing uh, pretty much leveled up. And then we'll be moving from, I uh, from Yao Yao to Kole stuff. 
Ba 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 da ba ba. Oh yeah. Here. I'll wait till like the last days and we go through all the kitty the cats pets pettings and stuff like a last goodbye thing because who knows when the next time we can be able to pet cats oh man Oh, uh, yeah, those, uh, those would be, uh, unfortunately, yeah, okay, 50. Oh, look at Bunny! That's so cute. All right, my co-op's on. Let's see something. Yeah, be careful with YouTube because that's where, unfortunately, it it, it it does get hard to. Oh my gosh! But oh my gosh, guys! Uh, guess what? So, Zhao Edit, who stops by every now and then, sent me a picture. So, if you guys know Anthony, Anth uh, Anthony, uh, who does Genshin streams, it's like that. Well, he released a late April Fool prank video. And in the video, he shows him on the computer on YouTube trying to look for people pulling for Chi Chi because he wanted a real good, uh, good video of pulling Chi Chi for the prank. In the search list, my video for pulling Chiori on Chiori banner showed up on his on his search thingy. So I kind of got noticed, but kind of not. <laughs> It just, it was, it, it just showed in his video, it shows in my video, my, one of my streams, titles, and stuff like that on YouTube, but I'm pretty sure Anthony has no clue who I am, but still, I got kind of noticed. <laughs> uh, Anth Anthony, just type in Genshin and Anthony, Anthony, and then you'll find them. It's more like Anthony Chen, Chan. All right, Julie Scott, gotcha. Just uh, and it's a it's the title of the video is prank. I prank uh, I put I pranked my stream uh, and something Chi Chi. No, don't do that, Humberto. Don't do that. Don't do that. Uh, that's actually that's kind of disrespectful to uh. To, to, to people uh, when like people go into someone else's videos and comment saying hey check out my streamer videos or uh, y'all should check so and so that's kind of, that's actually disrespectful so don't don't do that please don't do that Humberto Let's see. One, two, three, three, four, and three. 
But yeah, Zhao Edits just sent me a pic sent me a picture of that yesterday, and I saw the video today, and I was like, <laughs> I th I just thought it was very cool and interesting to tell you guys. I realize now my mistakes. Oopsies. I'll uproot you. <laughs> Can't see. Keep up. Also, so please be a good attack, Sam. Nope, HP. So that's fodder. Uh, okay. So when you're a, when you're a tester, uh, you have you you are strictly like prohib. You have to like, um, you can't really give much information because uh about the upcoming patch, um. And with Genshin, Genshin now has a thingy where like uh, uh, you have to say their their game is pretty much good. Uh, so a lot of people, so a lot of content creators got like upset about that. And it's only it's not like like everyone still entitled their opinion, uh, but like if they're doing like a content thingy with uh, with Genshin. Uh, like, like they have like, uh, like they get paid by MiHoYo to like stream, uh, and talk about their game. Then like they have to like kind of stay positive. So a few content creators that uh, who probably did do programs like that with Genshin uh, got upset about that. Uh, but like for me, um, I, I I stream Genshin and I play Genshin. For my purpose only. Uh, so, like, if I like, if I ever like, be like, oh gosh, this artifact sucks, or uh, like, oh no, I hate this game. Uh, it's more of just I hate the uh, the game because the artifact RNG is so bad. But um, like, I'm not gonna get in trouble or anything like that because I, I, I like again, I'm not in that content program. Uh, you can always just rewind. Uh, the, for the rest of it, Humberto. <laughs> but yeah, you kind of get what I was saying. I hear everything. Go, cross over. Let's nip that in the butt. Keep up. Boba, get them. Let me have a go. Water. Go. I think Blue said uh, Zilla Zone had a sign-up thing for testers. Yeah, but uh, they did, but that's, uh, I think that ended. Because Zilla Zone is uh, coming out in, uh, sometime this year. We don't have, like, a, a, we still don't have, like, an official release date, date for it compared to, like, Weathering Waves com coming out. Oh, yeah, hang on. 17, 16, 16, 16. Yeah, no, I can move on. Um... Who do I want to level up next? Yeah, I'll just start doing Kali stuff. Uh, Is there time for a quick snack? I'll whip one up in no time. Uh, 
Okay, I remember getting a... Hold on. Bad Thunder Seether Flower. No, it was that one. Uh, and an HP Thunder Fury Sands that needs to go. Dang it. Well, I'll still keep it because energy recharge is very much... Uh, I definitely need energy recharge. Okay. Alright, we're halfway done, Julius. We're halfway done. After this claim, I'll be at 80 resin. Yeah, I understand. Like, I don't know. Like, that's why Weathering... If I do play Weathering Waves, uh, or Zealous Zone, I'm, those are gonna be games that I, I won't be able to stream. Because I already have three games. Like, they might just be, like, TOF, where I literally just play them for, like, I hear five, everything. ten minutes, and then I'm done. Zealous Zone, uh... <laughs> I don't have, like, I'm definitely gonna be, like, probably more picky with the characters I want to pull for, for that game. Uh, Weathering Waves, there's only two characters that, three characters that I want in that game. Uh, but of course, uh, PlayStation got delayed, so. Dang it. I'm gonna eat some food. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, there we go. HP, okay, I can burn that. Yeah, I like to keep stock with food, because better to have plenty of food than no food at all. I need to, like, I need to do a day again where, like, I go through food, uh, learn new, learn new foods, get the rest of the food recipes, now that they added more. Because I had almost every recipe in the game, minus the ones that were probably, like, chest and quest specific. I'll uproot you! I hear everything. Can't see. Keep up. I mean, I got double XP, which is nice, but man... Okay, I might end up having to give her crit damage then. <laughs> I 
Yeah, once you get gold, like there's really no sense of holding, uh, holding it, holding them. That's the only crit rate one I have, so that crit rate might just end up going to like, I don't know, Kiara or somebody else. I'm gonna have to... I'll uproot you! One with the force! resin julie it's 40 resin well we'll be at 20 after after my next claim so this claim and one more and we're done and then i'll be on star rail and star rail is going to be like 20 minutes uh because i fixed my because i fixed my sleep schedule um and i just want to do credits i want to because what, what, i want to i'm trying to make sure i get i still get enough credits I'll uproot you! Fire, fire. Keep up. Yeah, I can do that. Keep up. Keep up. Keep up. Keep up. Keep up. Keep up. Uh, Genshin, I'm, I'm a tr uh, Genshin, I'm rich. Uh, Starro, uh, once I level up my characters, like, I'm gonna end up broke. Oh my gosh, no, wrong thing. <laughs> Ignore that. That's my luck. Wow. 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 Crit rate, crit damage. 83 percent Geo You know what? Screw it. Screw it. I'll lock it. I, I don't get double crits. I'm going to take advantage of that. Maybe I'll bait. Maybe like. <laughs> Why can't we have. Oh, you know what? Man, can we have like more HP Geo characters like like Zongli, like for real, for real? I hear everything. <laughs> Can't see. <laughs> Dude, I would have been more happy if that was like an Electro Cup, cause like, man. Okay, I'm gonna do something, hold on. Cause 
I got like a flower or feather or something. Thank you, Double XP. Okay, I like that. I like that energy recharge. Okay. I am doing a DPS, Noel. And that one's gonna burn. And we're done. Alright, so I got an HP set five star stands to burn. But yeah, we're done with Genshin. Let me quickly I'll level up that uh that other feather I got real quick. Yeah, what, yeah, break effect, uh, that pinkish blue set that you get from Weekly Boss is Humberto, that's the one, that's the break effect set. Alright, thank you Julius for, for helping me out. Oh man. We got some five stars, not the crit, crit damage or crit circle that I'm looking for, but A, they, uh, they were still bad five stars at least, so, uh, except for that one Geo Cup, so they were just mostly fodder at this point. Alright, okay, let me level up that other Thunder Fury Feather, so I know if I can trash that one or not. Yeah, you know what? I'm getting rid of that one. I'm gonna get rid of that. That. Hi, Mexican Paimon. I'm actually about to be ending my Genshin stream in just a, a bit. And fodder. I'm, about, I'm burning that. Uh, I'm keeping that one. Because that one's going kind of bad, so... I'm kind of hoping it goes bad. Yeah, better. I have better ones.
Oh yeah, so worth doing that. <laughs> Look at that, and I already got, I got rid of like four feathers. See, this is why I was, this is why I've been doing this. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. dude, there's no like ah. So I'm liking that one. Now I have that one. Cause there's uh, like, oh man, I kind of want more electro characters though, for real. All right. Alright, I will see you guys uh, in a little bit for Star Rail in 7 minutes. Uh, I will quickly grab a snack, like maybe a cookie or something like that, because I'm getting a little bit like, uh, a little bit hungry. Uh, so I'm going to grab a snack, like a cookie or maybe uh, crackers. Uh, but yeah, so I'll be, I'll be live in 7 minutes for Star Rail. Um, wait, hold on. Blue screen for a second. Yeah, yeah, we're good, we're good. Okay. Um, what's it great about Rame is you can put her on any team and still dominate. Yeah, like, that's what Harmony characters are for. You can pretty much put them on any team. They'll work because that's Harmony. Uh, it's like that. Um, but yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in seven minutes. If not, then you guys take care, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, and you guys have a good uh, rest of your day. Uh, and, but yeah, for the rest of you guys, I'll see you guys in seven minutes for Star Rail. Uh, Star Rail will be just be like a 20 minute stream. Uh, I'm going to farm a little bit of credits, uh, get what I need, my dailies done, and that's it. Because, the reason, because, uh, my sleep schedule got fixed, so I'm not trying to ruin it. Uh, and I'll be back at like 10 o'clock in the morning, so that's why I'm not trying to burn all my Trailblaze power. Because I'm going to be on early early and stuff but yeah so i'll see you guys in a little bit uh if not you guys take care but yeah i'll see some of you guys soon bye guys